Ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, this is a women's contest, except for one fall. In the corner to my right, from us. Australia? New Zealand? I'm sorry, it's all, Australia's better, I'm sorry. Ladies and gentlemen, B. Priestley! Our ring announcer for tonight, Rob Lynch of the London Rights. His geography may be a little off, but that is right, indeed B. Priestley. Participant number two on my left, she's the current IPW UK Women's Champion. From Peckham, Tennessee, Tennessee Honey! Tennessee Honey, our IPW UK Women's Champion, still, still without her championship belt. You may remember, it was recently in Tunbridge at final chapter in the mixed tag where Tennessee Honey and Jonathan Winter took on Rob Lynch and Jetta. And Tennessee Honey felt her title. She felt her title for the first time, but not in the way she wanted to as Jetta smashed Tennessee Honey in the face with that championship belt giving Tennessee and Windsor the disqualification victory in that contest, but not giving Tennessee Honey the redemption that she is so clearly desperately seeking. And tonight she takes on B Priestley from New Zealand. You'll remember she recently had a victory over Rosie Lee at the Future 15 event in Selsdon. And it's a shoulder tackle from B there that sends Tennessee Honey down to the canvas. And there we go, Tennessee Honey, real awareness. That spirit she has trips B Priestley up and applies a headlock of her own here. B reverses into a wrist lock. Tennessee Honey attempts an escape there, but B holds on to that wrist lock, tightening it up here. Chris Hatch asking if there's a submission, asking if Tennessee Honey gives up, but it's going to take so much more to make this young lady quit. Far much more than a wrist lock, which B still has applied here. Although if she does manage to break that wrist, it will be so hard for Tennessee Honey to continue in this contest. Tennessee Honey attempts the monkey flip there, but still, still B holds on to that wrist lock. There we go, Tennessee Honey, she's escaped. Snapmare. Off the ropes. Low drop kick. And Tennessee Honey has finally evaded the grasp of B. Uh, maybe I spoke too soon. Rear waist lock applied. You have to wonder what B is looking for at this stage in the contest. I can't imagine a German sweeper. She's not quite got, got the grip of position. You can see the way that Tennessee Honey is bouncing, using her weight to try and evade being lifted, evade being thrown over B's head. Looks for a headlock there. Oh, and fantastic escape there from Tennessee Honey and grabs the headlock on B here very slow technical opening to this contest from these two young ladies hammerlock applied by B and B's been looking very impressive in the opening minutes of this contest Although this is only her second match here in IPWK. Sorry, I apologize. Third match here in IPW UK. I'm forgetting the tag match at Swanley Dome. B is looking very impressive. As Tennessee Honey now looks for this world of sport inside reversal. Manages to reverse into a hammerlock of her own here. B 
attempting this this Brazil herself. But no, no, no escape there. I know that Tennessee Honey has trained with some world of sport greats. Johnny Kidd, Marty Jones, the kind of people who who would have developed and perfected this style. And she would alert the techniques from them. I'm not sure if B Priestley has done the same. Maybe why she couldn't hit that, but oh! Just sends Tennessee Honey face first into that top turn behind her. Big boot. Smashing away there. And the pace, the tideless contest has suddenly changed. And B Priestley is losing her temper here. Pounding away. And, and I think Chris Ash is just as squalified B. Hash telling B what for there to the crowd's delight. Tennessee Honey with that discus clothesline. Once again, not the result Tennessee Honey wanted, but a victory nonetheless here at Future 16.